What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to create a review page using Elementor free WordPress plugin. First of all, make sure that you have Elementor installed on your WordPress website. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below in a card over here, here for a video where I do explain how to do that. But first of all, that gives to this page a title on WordPress dashboard pages add new. As soon as you do that, click on edit with Elementor blue button. We're gonna be loading the Elementor front end editor screen and let's create the page layout. First of all, let me choose three columns so we can apply a review. I'm gonna be using as example something like a web hosting services review. I'm going to apply a heading to this page, like for example, hosting reviews. Let me select this raw or this section and move it up. But before, let me apply a text block. Now, to the section to the top, and edit this description text. That's gonna be our subheading. Something like, what are you gonna do on this page, for example? Let's imagine that you may do a review of some mobile phones or some hosting service or some other kind of service that you like. After that, to the three column section, let me just align the heading to the center. Now, other headings, one for each product that we're gonna do a review. I just gonna display three reviews into this page, so three columns and three headings. The hosting one, the hosting two, or the hosting three. You can change this for any word that you can imagine. For example, Cloudways, Kingston, Bluehost, site origin now the subheadings so we can write up our reviews our experiences and the most important thing that is the star rating elementor have for free a star rating widget that you can that can be very useful for this kind of pages First of all, I'm gonna edit the rating scale for 0 to 10. And after that, let me apply the how much I like to this hosting option one. You have two font sets to play with. I do prefer the font awesome, but feel free to edit yours. And the style of the star. Now the title or hate. Now, as you can see, you can edit the typography and the text color. In addition, you can select the gap between the text and the stars. Secondly, you can edit the colors for the stars, the size of the stars. And finally, into the advanced tab, you can play with the spacings. We do have another video on our YouTube channel where I do explain how to play with spaces using Elementor. Finally, you have the alignment option. 
for the star rating we really get. There is extra options into the advanced tab that is some for the pro users and some others that is for free. For example, this, the position in the border, the background, the effects. But as you can see now, we already have some pre-build review. Now, let me clone this, let me duplicate and move to the others and edit the star rating. Now, let me change the heading, the title for the review. Hosting 1, Hosting 2, and Hosting 3. And finally, we can apply some, some features to each hosting review. For example, unlimited banded reach, the camera power, if you are doing a review of a mobile phone, for example. The same thing, we're gonna do need a editable text block and write up the key points. Use enter to separate the text, select all. The entire WordPress Editor Toolkit is here, but we are looking for the points, the bullet points. And it is. We have our hosting name, our project name, the description, the bullet points, and the star rating review. Let me duplicate. Move around. Edit the features, of course, and it is, we do have our Hosting plan package review. Now to the heading, the first heading, I'm gonna apply a padding to the top. And in the end, the subheading, I'm gonna apply a padding to the bottom. A positive one may work better. <laughs> and it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question, and don't forget to check out the visualmodo.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes with full compatibility to Elementor page builder. And it is. I hope you guys all the best and I see you later.